Okay, so these are all the different sets that we have that we've collected over the years, um, starting in 2009 with their original. And that original one was the Winter Toy Shop, and it was um, a toy shop with a tree and a bunch of mini figurines and a bench and a couple of skiers. And then the next year was the bakery, and that one came with the bakery, um, an ice rink, a guy um, hauling trees with a horse and the carriage, and then a guy in the back who um, was a tree vendor. And then the next year was the post office, and that one came with um, the post office, and then an old fashioned mail truck, and another bench, and then also it has a bandstand with a couple of guys playing instruments that looks like um, a banjo and a saxophone. And then the following year we got the um, Winter Cottage, I believe it's called. And that one also came with um, additional pieces, a snowplow and a guy with a sled. And there's a lumberjack or a woodcutter guy with a saw and a little shed. And then it also came with a little igloo and a couple of skiers. And then between 2012 and 2018, they released a bunch of different sets, but none of them had, or very few of them had, um, one of the key components that we really love, which is the light brick. And so we decided to pass on those, but just for information, the ones that we passed on were in 2013, they did um, like an outdoor marketplace that had a bunch of little booths. And then in 2014, they did Santa's Workshop, which actually I think um, if I were to try to get one more set that's actually out of production, it would be that one because that one came with a workshop for Santa and Mrs. Claus and then it had reindeer and some elves and a sleigh and um, all the little trappings of what Santa's Workshop ought to be. And then in 2015, they re-released the toy shop, which was the original one with some updated um, toys, I think, for Under the Tree, and then there was like a sticker for the sign and a couple of um, different parts. And then in 2016, they had um, a train that was complete with track, and the following year they had a station that went with the train, and I don't think either one of those came with the light bricks, so we decided not to get those. Um, but then back in 2018, we didn't get this one until 2019, but um, back in 2018, they released the fire station, and um, so we got this one last year, and the release for last year was actually um, a gingerbread house with gingerbread people in it, and it didn't really fit in with the style of the other ones, so we decided to pass on that. Oh, and also in 2019, if you buy things like um, on one of their promotional days or like Black Friday, then they throw in a little extra, so we got a little reindeer. Um, and also I've mentioned back in 2012, I think on what they call Brick Friday, which is like their Black Friday, equivalent and they give you a freebie if you buy it. Um, so we got that one came with a bench and a lamppost and um, a sled with a horse and some passengers. And then finally this year, um, as you can see, they've kind of changed the branding a little bit. Um, they released the Elf Clubhouse, which came with a bunch of elves and um, some additional with a new fancy reindeer and um, a bunch of little accessories and a tree with like even fancier toys. So over time, they've kind of um, changed the way that they do the toys. Like these are the toys from this year. That's a pirate ship and an airplane. And way back when, and back in the early days, everything was kind of made out of bricks. Um, so they've um, updated things over time. But um, anyway, those are all of our sets. So now that you've previewed those, I will show you the details. Okay, so starting, um, we have two shelves, as you can see, because um, it's grown so much that we need a lot of space for this village every year. Um, so starting out with, these are actually our oldest and newest sets. So this is the toy shop. Um, and then there's the toy maker and his snowman. And this one, the light brick is up here and it lights up the workshop. And that one came with um, a tree with presents and a girl on a ladder and um, 
it was really like kind of innovative and we really loved it. So we decided that, you know, we would start kind of building this every year. And then this year's release was the, this is the Elf Club House, complete with tree with the presents. See, there's the airplane and the pirate ship. And here are the elves. Um, one of them has a computer where he's managing the nice list and the piano they built and the workshop and has a telescope and all kinds of neat goodies. Um, this is the uh, reindeer this year and we actually have our tree vendor over there who came um, with one of the much earlier sets um, but we just happened to be uh, stick him there because that's where it fit. So also over here is the snow plow which came with um, one of the sets, maybe the bakery, um, but there's a snow plow complete with um, cotton <laughs> snow. And um, oh yeah, so on the Elf Clubhouse, they have the, the light brick lights up the Elf's bedroom. And after I do the front view, I will do the back view of all of these, but you can see there's a little light brick there that lights up the inside. And then the next, here on the same shelf, we have the, this is the winter, cottage and that one the light brick is um, actually a fire in the fireplace so you can see it kind of lights up the inside and that one also came with the guy who chops wood here and his little um, wood storage shed and next to that we have the the guy with the carriage that was the add-on set and here's um, one of the, this came with the original toy shop. This is an ice rink with um, a guy who actually crashed into a snowbank and a guy laughing at him and taking a photo. And here's the guy with the sled that came with the winter cottage. And then here's also um, some other various pieces that we've collected over the years um, that we just thought went well together. A guy throwing a snowball and a guy with his dog and a bone and a cat and another guy. Um, shoveling snow. So that's the front view, that shelf. The second shelf is here. Okay, here we go with the second shelf. So this was the second set that we got, which is the bakery, complete with the baker and his wife who has some baked goods wrapped as a gift. And the light brick on this one lights up uh, their display window, which is really cute. It has some pastries and a little croissant in there and like a fun puff pastry. And that there is the add-on from last year, which was like a cool reindeer um, that we're kind of using as like a statue and the igloo complete with owl um, from one of the other sets. I think maybe the cottage set. Okay, so then the next set we got was the post office, which is here, really cute. And the light brick on this one lights up the desk and there's a mail carrier with her little backpack. There's another mail carrier on skis, additional people skiing. Turn around, there we go, skiing the right direction. And here's the old fashioned um, mail truck and complete with um, little packages. It's really cute. And then the guy um, delivering trees. And also with the post office was the band stand. So there's the guys playing their instruments. And um, actually with the original set, which was the toy shop, there were a couple of carolers that came with it. And here they are. So they're singing um, along with the band stand. And so, and then last year, the final set that we got last year, um, which was really cool, and we hadn't, we first we got in a long time after not buying any for a long time, was the fire station, um, complete with a little hockey rink, and the first Lego baby that we have in our collection. There it is right there. And a tree with a little scooter and a train, and also a fire engine really cool and a fireman taking a break on a bench 
And this one actually had a fun little snowman with it. So now I'm gonna um, go on the back and show you what all those parts look like. Oh, and the light brick on this one lights up um, here, lights up the room on the top floor. Okay, so here's the rear view of the Winter Village, starting with um, the toy shop, which is where we started with the front view. So it's really cool because from the back, a lot of these sets have really neat little touches and features and the Lego folks somehow managed to think of everything. So for example, the light brick lights up the little workshop where the toy maker makes his toys. There's the light brick right there. And then it has inside a couple of toys on display, a train and a robot and a fireplace for keeping warm or I guess forging the toys and a little cash register right there and a ladder that goes up to the workshop. And then here's the back of the Elf Clubhouse, which is so cool and fun. So again, here's the light brick and there's little beds for the elves here. And what's really cool is they have a feature where the clock shakes the elves awake so they get out of bed to do their work and they have neat little they have a, like a little um stove where they can make some more beverages in there and a lamp and a chair and then if you come downstairs there's their table where they eat yes waffles and they have um little mugs and there are the elves posing with santa and the back of their door and then they have a kitchen and a wrapping space with scissors and a box and wrapping paper and then the coolest thing ever they have a waffle dispenser so that you can cook your waffles and then it tips down with a little pan of waffles and then there's also um, a telescope here and a stocking on the back of the chimney, and that's what it looks like from this side. So there's that. And then moving over to the cottage. So here's the little woodcutter's shed in closer view with some wood stacked up there. And here's the outside of the cottage. There's the fireplace. There's a control for the light brick right there, right here. And when you turn on the light brick, it's this is really fun. It lights up the fireplace. And then inside, there's a chair for reading the newspaper and there's little touches like a picture hung on the wall and a Christmas tree and a chandelier. And in the upstairs, there's a kid's bedroom which has a toy in it, which is a, an airplane. And there's also a toy boat. And then in the downstairs, there's a kitchen complete with cabinets and a sink. And it's really cool. I love the checkerboard floor. So that is the uh, back of the winter cottage. And then coming down to the bakery. This is what the bakery looks like from the back. And so there's the little stove for cooking it and the light brick. There's a paddle for moving, removing items from hot items from the oven. And they have a little cash register and some money for where they sell all their baked goods. And upstairs, there's like, maybe like a little workspace um, where they store things, I don't know. And then, okay, so coming to the post office, which was the next one. This is what the post office looks like on the inside. There's a little office in here, right there with a mug and a little space here for um, where they sell and you can place packages and they sell them. And um, here there's a fake fire on this one, but it's still cute that they did a fire. And here's a light brick on this one. So this one's kind of bright. I just replaced the batteries and all these, so it's pretty bright. And then they have a little workspace over here where people can come in, I guess, and wait in line and wrap up their packages. And here's the back of the little bandstand. And then finally, the 
back of the fire station, which is really cool. So here's the back fire station, the upstairs, there's an eating space. They have a little bone for the dog. This is a bed, which actually folds up. And then there's a photo, a couple photos there. And then they have, um, like a coffee maker and this is their whole kitchen with complete with sink and cabinets and there, of course their red telephone and hot dogs, I guess for hungry firemen. And then downstairs they have their fire extinguishers and a helmet and supplies, which include an ax, a couple of axes and a, a pick of some kind. And then of course there's a fire pole for the firemen when they're in a rush, because they come from eating and then they run through, go down the pole, and then they can exit to get onto the fire truck promptly. And here's what it looks like lit up. So, and then coming around the side, there's the snowman. And yeah, so that's our winter village. Um, I hope you like the tour and um, yeah, that's it. Um, so this is one of my favorite parts of the holidays, and I hope you enjoyed it. Thanks.